rather than to use this to record but in actuality this is way easier so i'll bring in lots of questions my voice is so messed up right now there's so many questions um about my school about how i'm living what my dorm looks like it's a mess just going to read them off my phone so i'm looking down at my phone i'm in the international airport and it's actually quite far from seoul um i think it took us like almost two hours to get home i need to stop going out we thought you had to get a t20 card in actuality we took the express train and uh you just had to buy that. I think groups of four or more is about 2,000 Korean won cheaper. Our seats are assigned and you have to sit in that seat and we went there and then um, that actually took us to City Hall and then uh, Line 1 took us to my school. There are very few escalators here, um, a lot of stairs and like no elevators. <clears throat> I'm not sure if uh, the handicap ratio is just really low here or if we just didn't know where to go. With two big suitcases, it's pretty hard to get somewhere. And people are really nice, but it's embarrassing, so you just act like you can do it when in reality you can't really. Um, boys help me um, take my bags and show me where I live. And uh, yeah, how bad's the pollution? So the last two days um, are pretty polluted, and I definitely feel it. It looks like brown clouds. I didn't get a mask, and maybe I should, but it's like I don't know. If you're a smoker, I don't think it bugs you, but like I don't smoke. And between like the smog and going out and being out late. Like, that's why I sound like this, <laughs> and that's why like my eyes are swollen and my nose is swollen. But uh, it's just smog. Like Canada has it too. So if you have asthma, it's a little tough. But transportation is amazing. Like there's so many trains. I think there's like nine or ten. Like don't like don't. I'll just say how much. Or, like one goes directly to my school. One goes directly to Gangnam. One goes directly to Dongdae Moon, everything. Like, it just takes you anywhere you want to go. Then, like, taxis. Everybody was like, it's so expensive. I wanted to go home, so I got in a taxi. And I was like, oh no, like, we have enough cash. It was like a 45 minute taxi ride, and it cost us 18,000 Korean won. That's like 20 bucks. If you're from Canada and you're used to overpaying things, like, it's fine. So I guess seem to be having a really bad time being called fat or being told they're crazy when they laugh. Ajumas, like telling me I'm cute. One told me I had too much luggage. But nobody's been rude. Everybody's been really nice. Like when we get lost, we can just ask people. And even if they don't know English, they like actually want to help us. So it's good. Okay, let's go grocery shopping. Like, we have a double stove and a microwave and a fridge and stuff. Like, let's go grocery shopping and save money. For Canadian, the groceries are really cheap. I think maybe, like, the peaches are too much. But I found out I'm allergic to peaches, so... Everything's cheaper. Like, everything's so much cheaper here. I don't understand. Canada's so expensive. And it's really expensive compared to Europe, but, like, compared to Canada. It's actually cheaper to just go out and eat. They're so big. Between like 2,500 Korean won, so like $3, three Canadian dollars, to like 10,000 Korean won, so like $12. So much food. So good. So good. So it's definitely cheaper just to go out and eat in Korea. Like, no, just shut up. Just shut up. <laughs>